Yo guys, what's up? How's it going? So today we're looking at crypto and we're looking at one coin to rule them all. What coin is it? Is it Bitcoin? Well, no. Bitcoin's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome, right? Had a high of 67,000 or so, but it's down 30% over the last three months. So you can see some of the tokenomics here. Maximum supply, 21 million. Capped, all-time high, 68,798.60. Cool. All right, Bitcoin is awesome. Bitcoin's gone back to its previous highs, to 100K, then 200K, and then who knows how high it's going to go. Some people say 1.5 million. Some people say 2 million, 10 million. I don't know. Sky's the limit. You can see I'm accumulating. But let's look at the next coin. All right, coin number two, Ethereum. Is Ethereum the one? No, no, Ethereum is not. Ethereum is awesome. Okay, we can, let's go down here. We have a high, all time high of $4,891.70. Awesome. Okay, max supply, zero. I don't know what happened there, but that's not right. Total supply, 119.2 million Ethereum. All right. My shorter term guard target for this coin is 5,000 next three to six months. And then 10,000 next six to 12 months. Six to nine months, six to 12 months. And then from there, it could go to 20K, 30K. Like Bitcoin, sky's the limit. But, so yeah, it could be a 10x. Cool, cool. Alright, is this, is this the one? Is this the coin to rule them all? No, because it's got high fees. Ethereum fees are crazy high. Let's look at the next one. Alright, now we're looking at Crow Coin. Okay, is this the coin to rule them all? Well, it could be. Fees are super low. Crypto.com is one of the big exchange, biggest exchanges in the world. Lots of firepower behind this guy. Lots of new projects. VVS Finance. Okay, got Tonic. Single offering coming out. Lots of stuff happening here at Crypto.com. Lots of developers jumping on board. Uh, really good DeFi wallet. Really good interest for staking. Both in the main app and in the DeFi wallet app. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Look, up 142% over the last three months. And that's not even, it's off of its highs of almost a dollar. All right, let's go down here. The high was 96 cents, almost 97 cents. Now, supply side is a bit high, all right? But it's okay. It has a really good use case. And Bitcoin's got the Lightning Network, but the Crow's got Crypto.com and the debit card. And they're looking to expand even further the utility of this thing. And the NFT space here on Crypto.com is blowing up and it's all based on the Crow. Yeah. So, short-term price target, three to six months, a dollar. And then... In less than a year, two dollars, and then I think we're going to five dollars. Mm, might take two to three years, but beyond that, this is gonna be a twenty dollar coin, and that's where you're gonna start seeing some real dividends pay off. But that could take a while, all right. We're talking about 2030. This could be a twenty dollar coin, but that being said, we're gonna be seeing massive growth here. And I think it's still cheap enough to get in. I had 10,000 crow. I had over that. I think I still have over that. Between DeFi Wallet, over at VVS Finance. It's just spread out a little bit further. And uh, all the different coins that I have in the portfolio. So, let me know what you guys think. I've been accumulating a bunch of different coins here. Crypto.com, and I think Crow has a lot of potential, 
but the one I think has more potential is Kaz Contentos. All right, that's going to be a new virtual world NFT space, the whole shebang, and this is still cheap. This could be also a $20 coin in the next, I don't know, five years. Look at Sandbox. Look at Mana. Look at all these virtual real estate plays. They are just blowing up all over. And these guys are coming out with theirs this year in 2022. So go check it out. Watch my other videos. Be sure to subscribe for more updates. And let me know what you guys are looking at. Thanks for watching.